Now let us understand the next algorithm is distance vector algorithm. In this algorithm, distance vector is iterative, asynchronous and distributed algorithm. So let us understand how it is iterative, asynchronous and distributed. So first it is distributed in that the each node received some information from one or more node which is directly attached the neighbor means it received the value or some information from one or two or more node which is connected so perform a calculation and then distributed the results of that calculation back to that neighbor so based on that received information they can calculate and distribute that results to the their neighbors now why it is iterative because so process continue on until no more information is exchanged between the neighbor means the process of iterative process is continue until there is no more information need to be exchanged between the neighbor next it is asynchronous algorithm because it does not require all of the node to operate each other now let us understand how it works see dx of y be a cost of the least cost path from node x to y so here in this algorithm the least cost are calculated by bellman ford equation in this equation the dx of y means cost of the least path from x to y then here equation of this algorithm means here the c of x comma y means the cost to neighbor v and here it's cost from neighbor v to destination y so it better to understand this algorithm in example each node is waiting for change his local link cost or we can say return back message from the neighbor then it's calculate means recalculate the estimate value and if that dv to any destination has changed then notify their neighbor the node value is changed so it notify to their neighbor and again it send to the neighbor all other neighbor let us understand the example of distance vector algorithm in this algorithm we have this network total three node which is connected each other with each own value means cost now for the node x table from x node to x node it value is zero from x to y node c x to x is zero x to y is two x to z is seven so the x to x is zero x to y is two x to z is seven rest of field is infinitive now for the node y table x to x x to y x to z the first row is infinitive now for the node y so the node y to x means y to x so value is 2 y to y 0 y to z 1 rest of field for the z infinitive for the node z table z to x z to x is value is 7 z to y value is 1 z to z value is 0 now after first iteration of all node table <coughs> forwarded to the next iteration of the neighbor tables now for the node x table all the row received a value from different node table c 201 received over here it is 2 0 2 and 3 so 0 2 and 7 here 0 2 and 3 so let us understand how this calculate in that c to calculate d of x y following equation c of x y means the cost of x to y is x to y is 2 plus c here plus d of y to y means 0 d of y to y means 0 plus 0 comma 
कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू जेड कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू जेड इज सेवन सी सेवन प्लस डी ऑफ डी जेड ऑफ वाई मीन्स डी जेड ऑफ वाई वन सो टू प्लस जीरो एंड सेवन प्लस वन एट सो मिनिमम वैल्यू इज टू सी टू सो टू ओवर हियर नाउ इन दिस वैल्यू डी ऑफ एक्स जेड डी ऑफ एक्स जेड सो इक्वेशन इज मिनिमम कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू वाई सो कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू वाई इज टू सी टू प्लस प्लस डी वाई ऑफ जेड डी वाई ऑफ जेड इज वन सो टू प्लस वन कोमा कोमा सी मीन्स कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू जेड कॉस्ट ऑफ एक्स टू जेड एक्स टू जेड कॉस्ट इज सेवन प्लस डी जेड ऑफ जेड मीन्स इट सेल्फ जीरो सो सेवन प्लस जीरो टोटल एट टू प्लस वन थ्री सो मिनिमम वैल्यू इज थ्री सो वी डी नोट ओवर हियर थ्री x y and z 2 plus 1 see the next row coming from here 2 0 1 y table and third row coming from z table 7 1 0 7 similar in this table now in this field 7 1 0 here 3 1 0 because here the value Z to x now Z to x Z to x seven but we have already calculated Z d of Z to x. It's similar calculation like this value. So the instead of seven three this value forwarded to further tables. so the final table value c these are the routing table of each node 